Hello guys and welcome to the series of video where I will show you everything there is to show about Sarpstat. In the first video I will show you the basics, I will show you how to create the project, how to find information about Sarpstat and where everything is. In the next videos I will go step by step and show you every model of Sarpstat. I will show you keyword research, domain analysis, backlink analysis, site audit, rank tracking and our tools. So let's jump in. This is the main page of Sarpstat and this is where you start your work with Sarpstat. And up here you have header, down here you have the footer, and I'll show you the main elements in header, footer, and on the page itself. In the search bar you can enter the main keyword or a link to your URL to start analysis, but we'll get back to those later. Right here you can change the search engine and the region you want to check. The most important thing on the main page is the green speech bubble button at the bottom of the page. It opens up the chat with our support and you can start a conversation, you can ask any question, they will help you out with anything. If you're not sure where to find certain data, just type in your question and you will get the answer. The average response time to the questions is 2 minutes, which is pretty quick, so don't hesitate. If you have any questions, click on this green button and ask your question. The main page also has a lot of information about Sorpstat. It has information about our features, system models from our users and all that. You can go ahead and check that out if you're interested in it. In the footer you can find information about Sorpstat. The most interesting parts are probably statistics, where you can see how many keywords we have in each database and how many databases we have and stuff like that if you are looking for a product to use with a certain country. Also we have links to the knowledge base, such as Serpstat Academy, use cases, user guide, frequently asked questions and so on. So if you have any questions and you don't feel like talking to the support and you want to do your own research, go ahead and check out the knowledge part of our footer. Also you have the links to our social media and other information about the service. In the now let's get back to header. Up here you have the links to the important parts of the website. If you want to see how to work with Sorpstat based on your own needs, click on this green button and one of our managers will show you how to work with it. In the top right corner you get your profile settings. On this page you can see how many requests you can make, how many limits you have left in your tariff plan. Uh, you can enter a trial coupon here. If you have a promo code you can just click here to, uh, to get a free access for a certain number of days. Also you have your API token here. You can copy it here, you can change it anytime in here. And you also have information on how many API requests you can make with your current tariff plan. Also here you have settings like uh, your name and password, you have information about your bills and you have the affiliate program link. This is where you can get your referral link. If you are a registered user of Sorpstat, you get your referral link and you can use this referral link to share it with your friends and if they buy Sorpstat by following your link, you will get bonuses. You can use the money you make with your referral link to buy a Sorpstat subscription or you can withdraw your money. If you have a white label reports included in your plan, you can enable them on this page and you can upload your logo here to work with white labels. And right here you have access to your previously created reports. So if you have downloaded your reports previously on a different computer, you can access those reports here and download them again. The rest of the links in the header are leading to our blog information about the features, prices and the tools we've created. On our blog we constantly publish content which can help you with optimizing your website, you can get cool tips on how to use Sorpstat and how to work with marketing in general, so make sure to check out our blog. Now let's get to the link to your list of projects. This is where you can access your projects or if you don't have any you can create your own project. To create a project click on this blue add new project button, enter a website you want to create a project for, uh, you can create a project for your own website, for your client's website or for your competitor's website. I'm going to create a project for Sorpstat.com. You can leave the project name and project group empty. If you leave your project name empty, we'll just use the domain address. And that's all you have to do to create a project. Once the project is created, you have it in your dashboard and you can start site audit and you can start rank tracking project. I'll show you how to work with this in the following videos. Meanwhile, you can check some basic analytics about your website. You can see what keywords it ranks for, what keywords ran in PPC campaigns, how many shares you get, and so on and so forth. That's it for this video, guys. In the next one, I will show you how to work with website analysis, how to work with domain and URL analysis. I will show you all of these features that you can see in the left menu, and I'll show you what they do and how to work with them. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.